I always thought that coming out of school, there would be a lot more things that would kind of naturally flow. You know, you've paid the price, you got the knowledge now, um, that it would just come. And I, and I didn't anticipate uh, how big the business challenges really are, how big the interpersonal challenges and in dealing with patients really are. I had a patient that came in um, about a couple of years ago, and it was a very difficult situation. She had been so fearful of the dentist, she hadn't seen a dentist in probably 30 years. After the time of talking to her, I couldn't break down those bridges of fear, and I felt I felt helpless. I felt, uh, I felt like I didn't, couldn't connect with her. And uh, needless to say, she left the office and she didn't have any procedure done. So I really felt like I uh, either didn't have the skills or the confidence to be able to break down those barriers to help her understand. And when I got done and I was leaving, I was thinking, oh good, I had a really productive day. So I checked my production and I didn't have a really productive day. I had a really busy day. And when I was driving home, I think I'm way too tired, I'm way too worried about some of the treatment I just did. I'm way too uh, strung out on uh, doubt right now to, to feel like I've had a good day. I didn't want to do that again. About eight years ago, um, I was diagnosed with non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. And so it, it was kind of a big wake-up call. And it was, okay, you know, this, this might not be the profession for me. And we'd actually um, had a dentist that was going to buy our practice and uh, we were going to do something else. But at the last moment, my wife and I looked at each other and said, no, we can't do this. We can't sell. This is, you know, something we've poured our whole life into. And so it was at that point we said, okay, if we're going to do this, we got to do something different. I've seen a thousand times, and there is a better way. The Dr. Dick Barnes group does not teach tips and tricks. We teach a philosophy which is as true today as it was 30 years ago, and three decades of successful dentists are proof of that. Dr. Dick Barnes is definitely a master motivator, and he understands dentistry because he is a dentist himself. And he had a practice where he helped patients, and he creates such desire and gives the dentist hope like no one I've ever seen before. And it's one thing just to give hope, but it's a whole other thing to give you a structure to help you to get there. I don't just work for Dr. Dick Barnes. I am a believer. I believe what he teaches. I've experienced it. And I hope that you too will carefully consider what he has to say. Hello, I'm Dr. Dick Barnes, and I've been around a long time. You can tell by the white hair. I've been a dentist for a long time. I've been teaching dentists for over 30 years. The structure that the Dick Barnes Group teaches works. It's a structure that'll enable dentists to have the type of practice that they wish they had many years ago. The way you see yourself is the way you'll become. If you see yourself successful, you'll be successful. If you see yourself doing comprehensive dentistry, you'll do comprehensive dentistry. If you see your patients being able to afford it, they'll have it done. I will challenge all of you to follow the structure. I dare you to try it, because if you do, I think you'll be really surprised at how successful you'll be. Obviously, my bottom line's really been helped. I started this practice I'm working now from scratch only two years ago, and I'm way ahead of schedule uh, for my area for the uh, type of volume that I'm doing. And on a real practical basis, I don't hurt as much as I used to. I, uh, I feel better at the end of each day about the, the technical aspects of the work I've done. I don't have uh, very many times anymore where I'm feeling a little nervous about what I just sent home with people. I know I'm doing great work. 
backed up by a great lab. But after I started taking these courses, applying the things that I've learned, we had Tawana out at training our staff. Um, I never check my schedule anymore. I, I just believe that it's going to be good. I never check my production anymore because I can feel how good it is. But more than that, I don't care as much anymore what those numbers are. But the day-to-day -day interactions with my patients are fun, and I get to have fun at work again. A couple of years ago, I went to Buzz Neighbor's office to take my first course with the Dick Barnes Group. And I can tell you, after a two-day course on a weekend, I went home more energized and pumped up about dentistry than, than anything I've ever done. I took home a surgical kit, placed two implants, and I just kept looking around to see when I could find the next case where I could place implants. The next month, I placed six implants, and you know, I really thought I was off to the races at that point. You know, six implants in a month. Now, it's six implants. I can do six implants in a week, I can do six implants in a day, I can do six implants in two hours. My office, we're average, you know, I've done over 300 implants already, and my life has completely changed from that weekend course. The Dr. Dick Barnes Group, it's where dentistry is going, and um, by following the structure and doing this, it has enabled us to be able to uh, utilize this technology in our office. It's made us much more efficient, uh, made our dentistry better, and it's benefited the patient because they've gotten better dental work. They've got, uh, it doesn't take as long to do their dentistry and it doesn't, uh, it's not as uncomfortable afterwards. We have increased our business fivefold. The payoff is um, unbelievable.